In 1976, Johnny Rotten and Sid Vicious played just 30 miles down the road, giving the Northwest music scene a right old knee trembler. The infamous gig. The infamous gig resulted in the birth of Joy Division, The Mondays, and Simply Red, and of course, this lot. John Peel's favourite band of all time have been going for 30 years, produced an incredible 78 albums worth of music, and been one of the British music scene's most influential bands since the Sex Pistols. They are the fall, and this is Mark E. Smith. <laughs> Mark, thank you very much for coming. Welcome to the show, yeah. and welcome to Liverpool. Obviously, you're a famous Mancunian. Is there a bit of rivalry between the two cities, do you think? Not at all, no. No, you, you, you love Liverpool. Yeah. Alright. 29. We got our first breaks in uh, Liverpool. Did you? Where was that? Eric's. All oh, right. It was, was, that... was a club. Uh... You used to play at 29 years ago, presumably, then, when the four. I'm not a big up. Manchester fan, actually. I'm, not, I'm a, a lot more fond of Liverpool. Though. 29 years, the four yes. have been together, over a thousand gigs. Right. And, uh, you know, you, you're back with a new album. Can, yes. Can, do you think it's the best? Work that it's you've the best done. thing I've done for a while. Yeah. yeah. It's a lot of uh, a lot younger sound or something. So you got this new lineup, so, and you think it's yeah. going to breathe a bit of new yeah. life in there. Uh, but yeah. your, your missus is, is still in there. And she was in the last lot, right? <laughs> right. Yeah. Did you ever think about sort of maybe replacing her, and then think, no, I, c I can't go that far? Don't get funny now. No, I'm just checking. No. Just asking. You've just written your autobiography as well, which is due out later in the year. Uh, yeah. With all of the kind of lineups that the fall have been through and all the past yeah. members, you know, could you remember it all yourself, or did you have to kind of well, get in got, touch got with a people? Ghost writer, yeah. Did you like Jordan? No, no. Um, okay, so you got someone else. Generally, a nervous breakdown. Really? Like the, the last three engineers who worked on the old. <laughs> is that something that you've done to them, Mark? Are you? Are you? Uh, well, I don't know. I don't know what it, it is. I don't know. I don't know. Do you think you're hard to work with? People seem to go a bit crackers when they're around me. Mm -hmm. I'm a nice fellow, as you can see. I, I can see that. You seem very nice to me. So the autobiography, you've got a ghost writer in. Did they have to contact members of the four previous members? No, that well, like, no, no, no. That's, that's, that's why I did it, to be honest. Yeah. Because there's been a lot of... There's, about, there's been about three books about the four. They're all rubbish. What was your favourite kind of memory that you got to relive? Meeting you at the NME Awards. Right, OK. Uh, we've got famous son of Liverpool, Ian McCulloch, on this show later. Oh, good, is he right? He is, he's good. He's given us a guided tour of the city. Have you ever been around Liverpool what, with Ian? Show? Yeah, he is, yeah. Slag. Go on. <laughs> Have you ever been uh, ripped up the city, ripped up Liverpool with Ian McCulloch? Uh, not really, no, no. Now, the fall have continued to be a big influence on, you know, loads of bands that are around today. I mean, I know Franz Ferdinand, Love You, Block Party, Always Going About You, even bands like LCD Sound System. Um, how do you feel about that? They don't sound anything like us. I think they don't have to sound like you to, to be influenced plague, by you. It's plaguing isn't it? Do you think so? Yeah. Do you, are there any bands around that you think have a bit of the spirit of the fall? The Reynolds girls from Liverpool, they were good. I'd rather Jack than Fleetwood yeah, Mac. Yeah. I've got that on 7 inch actually, it's, good, it's a good, good record. It's good, yeah. Who are you listening to at the minute then? Me? Mm. Um, myself. <laughs> Fair dooms, why not? I've heard it's a fantastic record. Right, it is a very good record. Yeah. Thanks very much, Mark. Mark E. Smith, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. He's off. Like a rabbit out of a trap. What next?